Welcome, in this video you'll see how to use one of the most important features of your Tricky workspace, Teams. I've set up some Teams already to show you some examples. We have three Teams listed here, showing the pictures of their managers, their managers and their status is active. The filter allows you to search through lots of Teams if you have a long roster of Teams. Let's now create a Team workspace for a new Team. And we're going to give the Team a title, we'll call it simply Sales and then we describe what the workspace and the team is about. We're going to choose a manager. Since we're a green company, we're going to give it a green look to the site. And I click on Create Team Workspace, and I have a workspace for the sales organization. This whole area can be modified. Um, here, team members can be added. Meeting minutes can be stored here. Projects that the team members are working on will appear here and then there will be team discussions as the team forms discussions and store documents and they can use all the power wiki to build a wiki for their special needs. Let's go back to an actual team I've already built before. We'll go to hardware engineering and you'll see the description of the team, the team members, they've put meeting minutes up, they list the projects they're working on, they've had a team discussion going on, and they have documents in their team documents. As you see here, we can store, for that team only, they can keep in their own special space, HTML, Microsoft Office, PDF, and other document types for their team. That's a little bit about Teams, and there are other videos on how to use more of the functionality in Teams available on our website.